Back to Louisiana Living. And welcome back. It's my pleasure to have Brittany McNamara with SOS Pets of Washita. That is who she is representing today. <laughs> <laughs> one of her many hats. And SOS Pets of Washita is one of the many sponsors of this year's Wolfstock 23. Brittany, thank you so much for coming on the show. Always great to have you. Well, thank you so much for having me. And yes, SOS Pets of Washita has always been involved in mm -hmm. the Wolfstock event year after year, um, primarily hosting the pet pageant, um, which we are proud to do again this year. Um, just a little bit about the event. I mean, it is this Saturday at Caroli Park from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Um, it's two dollars per person uh, to get in mm -hmm. and I think they're doing a they are doing a, a donation drive so you can bring there's a list of items on the Facebook event that you can bring up or bring to get in um, so but then for the pet pageant we have two categories small dog and large dog okay. it's a five dollar um, fee to participate in the pet pageant and guys it is it's just so cute year after year we have seen so many little animals come out in their tie-dye and different costumes and it's a lot of fun Too cute. Um, and so prizes will be awarded uh, to uh, the winners in each category um, DKS uh, will be mobile grooming all mm -hmm. the proceeds that they earn from their their grooming and stuff that day will be donated to SOS Pets of Washita and we are so grateful for their support year after year there is going to be a lot. There's going to be a lot. Um, so there's been a lot of exciting things going on in our in our community with the animals, and I think Wolfstock is going to be a great place to celebrate the next step for that. Um, as you know, the vote passed, and yes. we're going to be able to move forward um, with building a new facility for Washtenaw Parish Animal Shelter. Um, you know, and currently we're just trying to find the right location in partnership with uh, Washtenaw Parish Police Jury. And once we have that secured and, you know, what is going to be the best place, we'll move forward with the next step mm -hmm. and we'll make sure to let everyone know what that is. Um, so right after the, pageant. the pet pageant, <laughs> Um, that we are going to announce um, the Animal Advocacy Award. Mm -hmm. um, and a little bit of information about that, it's just an award that is given to a member of the community who is doing advocation and work for shelters and rescues and our animals here. And I actually got permission before I came on today that I can announce who our winner is. Right. Um, and so, especially because she has been such a huge mm -hmm. force for bringing a, a better uh, life to our local animals. So Joan will be receiving the Animal Advocacy Award at the Wolfstock event this Saturday. And y'all, I mean, without her, I don't know that we would have been where we're, where we're at with this new uh, animal shelter. So thank you to everybody who voted. Thank you to Joan. It's just really an amazing thing. And I'm just so happy to have been able to be a part of it these last few years. Well deserved. <laughs> yeah, she, d she has worked hard and she deserves it. And she's very humble. She'll tell you, it did take a team, but it was her inspiration that led that team. So, so we definitely encourage everyone to come to the SOS Pets of Washita booth and yeah. uh, cheer Joan on. Come cheer Joan on. Come check out. Come mm -hmm. chat with us. Come talk about what the next steps are. I mean, we're just it, we're doing this for our community, and you know, just let us know what you hope to see. And one more time, tell us the location of the event and the time. It's going to be at Caroli Park. Uh, begins at 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. The pet pageant starts at 12:30, and again, it's a five-dollar fee for the pet pageant so it's gonna be too cute it's it, it be is cute. A, um, a whole day full of mini vendors and we'll be discussing them and uh, visiting with the other vendors throughout the week so thank you so much Brittany, right, for thank coming you on so today. much thank you and up next on Louisiana Living we'll sit down with Kenya Robertson with the Monroe Regional Black Chamber of Commerce so stay with us